Hello everybody, I am back for potentially the finale of The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. I charged up my maple encounter, so let's see what she gives us this time. Ah! She dropped everything! And she even dropped a potion. That is amazing. Oh my god. That's that's better than the drop I got in friggin' Seasons. And I've been trying to get her to spawn that stuff. That kind of stuff. For a long time. Like, with all the encounters I've done. Like, holy, holy crap. At least that's freaking done now, and it figures that it's the last heart piece compared to one of the first seasons, but now that we have it... Good, I say. Let's get out of here. We can go directly to the Black Tower now. I will, however, I wish it would let me, hmm, do I want to, no, I, I did, this is on an emulator, so I'm not worried about losing progress, I got, yeah, I got save states set up, so, what I do is, between every bit of, like, harsh progress, I drop a save state. That way, if the video, like, corrupts or something stupid happens, I can just reload it. Ah. Dude, you don't have to. Ralph? Oh, no. If Ambie is slain, Ralph will never... <gasps> All right, Varen, you have overstayed your welcome by too much. We have to go all the way around. I don't care. We're going. That's it. This is basically the final dungeon of the game. It's not really much of a dungeon, but there is like a... a maze scenario up top. Just gotta be careful. Yeah, I purposely didn't buy the level 2 ring box, because one, I don't feel like grinding money... Two, we're just doing this file to get through the uh, general game that is Oracle of Ages. We're going to do the same thing with Seasons. Why is there a Beemos up here? Those statues are creepy. There's a Gibdo. Two Gibdos. Three Gibdos. I'm just going to leave all these enemies alone. Like likes. One, two, three, four, five. Why do they always, like... Make so many more like likes than other enemies in here. And now we have Dark Knights. Up. Sword Dark Knights. Stop that. Go away. 
I said, go away. Maybe it would have been better to bring the blue ring up here, or the green ring. So sword damage up, damage taken down. That would have been good. I think I like the heart ring, though. Heart ring's pretty good. What you got was robed. Oh, the the backdrop is changing. That's so cool. I love that. And we got more wizard robes. These. Hmm. So that should clear up this nonsense. There we go. Okay. Black Tower Turret. All right, so now we have to find our way through here. Let's, you know, let's not take these wizard blasts to the face. So let's go over here. Get away from me, dude. Can we... Dude, stop... pushing me. I want to speak to the owl. Truth glares at your back. At your back. So the way you come up... So I'm following these flames. I think this one specifically is the correct one. Yes, okay, that was the correct one. Good. If you step into the wrong one, it'll bring you down to those line owls, and we don't need that. Oh, this is where Ambi did her... Well, Varen did her, her sci uh, science. Okay, so that's just the same. All right. Don't do it, Ralph. No, I'm going to do the same thing I did before.
Just follow her movements. You're too lenient, Varen. It's fine, Ambi. You need to get the hell out of here now, though. No, you don't. Hmm? You dare. Shapeshifter Varen, everybody. This is the final boss of Oracle of Ages. That's done. What's next? I'm fine. All right. Oh. That is... Uh, strange. Oh. Oh, now we have the final... Oh, no. But my, aren't you courageous. Oh, jeez. All right, just keep your sword charged. Oh, jeez. What do we do here? Okay, she doesn't like that at all. We need speed. And we also need that. Okay, we got her. I skipped some text. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Oh, man. All right, so Varen has been eliminated. I'm here. Don't worry. Everything's good. I totally forgot about that. All right. That works for me. <laughs> it's 
Sweet. Everybody is back to normal. Let's go. You know, that is definitely a lot better than I do on Varen. I didn't even have to use the potion. I was just glad I had it, but... <laughs> Sweet. Well, you were honestly never ahead of me. <laughs> How rude, I'm still... <laughs> Don't call me Granny. Oh, that's hilarious. Of course. Hello, Ocarina of Time faces. Oh, wow. The flame of sorrow, which burns brightly. When this flame brightens the darkness, my wish will be granted. Oh, no. Twin Rova is as ugly as ever, honestly. The Legend of Zelda, Oracle of Ages. <sighs> Honestly, it feels good to have played through this game again. So now that we've actually cleared... Oh, there's a Link statue. Now that we've cleared this file, we should be presented with a secret that allows us to link our game and play through a different version of Oracle of Seasons. Oh, the poor tree... <laughs> <laughs> all right credits so we are going to do another run through of both oracle of seasons and oracle of ages but we're going to begin them with the passwords that we get in each of these finale in quotes episodes oh maple's listening <laughs> that's cute so I'm trying to f I'm still trying to figure out how I want to do this next playthrough. Most of the differences are in ages here. <laughs> he made himself dizzy. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Have a chiseling the statue. That's that's cute. <laughs> Thank you, Queenie. Again, it feels good to have gotten this game out of the way. At least this playthrough, anyway. But, uh, we have to go through it again. For extra stuff. Again, most of the differences as far as the secrets, or the secret length playthrough, um, most of those differences are gonna be in another playthrough of Oracle of Ages. There's some dialogue changes in Seasons, but I don't remember what exactly changes... I know that you start with, I'm pretty sure it's the sword, and input gives you a shield, and you also start with four hearts, and I might be pushing it a little on memory, but I think you begin with every ring that you had when you link the game file to the other game. I could be wrong about that. But you should be able to get all your rings from the other game into, well, the other game. But, yeah. 
Original Zelda staff. Sweet. That's always nice to see. In all honesty, I've been waiting so long for a remake of these games, Oil Close Seasons and Ages. I'm surprised that Nintendo hasn't gotten around to doing that yet. I think Link, the Link's Awakening remake was a huge success. And they have, like, all the assets, I would think, to create a remake in, the, in that style for these games. Ages and Seasons, that is. And that's the end of Oracle of Ages. So drop a like if you enjoyed the video and want to get it flowing and uh, recognized by other people. Drop a comment if you have something to direct my attention to or you just have something interesting that you want to point out. All ears. And I'm sure everybody else would be too. To support me and my work for the future and just to tell me in general that you want me to continue and that you enjoy what uh, I'm putting out, um, you can consider subscribing. That's the easiest way to help me grow and it lets me know that you approve of what I'm going to do and what I what I have done. And it lets me also know that you want to stay tuned for more. But with all that said, thank you so much for watching. And you should be able to slot this secret into... I'm laughing at the, uh, the second line there. You should be able to slot this secret into one of your games if you want to use the file that I used for my playthrough to go into Oracle of Seasons as a different secret to Holodrum at the top. So that'll link up your game with the game data that I put through my playthrough here. It'll be the same way when I get over the seasons for this. So again, thank you for watching, and bye bye